Okay, um, today my uh, video is going to be about um, moronic parents in the media. Um, before I start, a few opening comments. Um, uh, I'm not accusing all parents of being morons, just a select few. Uh, you'll know who I'm talking about once I start. Um, and uh, second of all, I'm going to be looping the song Blame Canada in the background of this video. Uh, from the South Park movie, because I think I count it as um, the theme song of, uh, well, it's a song parodying um, how stupid parents are when it comes to the media and how they blame everything else but themselves. Plus, I consider it the theme song for them. Like, whenever I read about a parent protesting a video game, the image of them comes to my head. The song, like, pops into my head. So, let's begin. Um, uh, every time, like, and, uh, every time a school shooting occurs, um, it's always, uh, they always set a video game, like, they go, well, if, the, if they didn't play Resident Evil or Grand Theft Auto, this never would have happened, and I'm like, no, uh, first of all, the game, video games have a clear rating, uh, system, right on the front of the box, and even on the back, where they say what it's for, um, if, it clearly says M, what the hell could M stand for if it's an M game? Mature. I mean, come on. Come on. I mean, how clear do you want? How clear does it have to be for you people? Can't you freaking read? Um, I, once again, this is not all parents. Like, I have very good parents. Um, I'm sure most of you do, too. I'm just talking about the parents who are protesting stuff. Um, second of all, okay, let's... I'm gonna, let's settle this. Video games do not influence thinking. Video games don't kill people. I'm gonna, you know, guns don't people, kill people. People kill people. Video games don't kill people. People kill people, okay? Um, and it's not because of the video game they're doing it. If little Timmy shoots up a high school, it's not because Grand Theft Auto influenced him to do it. If Timmy had even the, if T Timmy did it, little Timmy shot up a high school because he was messed up in the first place, okay? Uh, not the video game's fault. The video game probably didn't even push him to do it. Now, other people go, oh, but, um, Oh, but he even said it did. Like, sometimes kids will go, oh, if only I didn't play Grand Theft Auto. I'm like, okay, no, you didn't. Um, of course they're going to say that. I mean, they just want to get out of trouble. They want to look like a victim. Uh, it's common human mentality. I don't want to be in trouble for it. You know, the devil made me do it. Um, let's get into movies now. Uh, back in 2006, when uh, Beowulf came out, um, there was all this controversy that's PG-13. Like, oh, how could this be PG-13? Uh, a little bit for the violence, but not so much. No, I think this is hilarious. For the, uh, sexual content found in the movie. Um, you want to hear what the sexual content was? Uh, Angelina Jolie is like this creature, like this, like, I don't know, I don't want to say demon. It's kind of like a demon thing. And you can vaguely, very vaguely see her tits on the, uh, because she's supposed to be naked. You can vaguely see, like, I could barely even see it. Like nipples, and they're even golden colored. And they're like, oh no, this, this could be rated R, my kid's going to be corrupt. Um, no. Uh, there's... How is that going to corrupt you? Half the world has these, you know? Uh, I don't have them. I'm sorry. Um, half the world has boobs. Half the world has dicks. Why is that such a disturbing thing if your kid sees one? There are much worse things you could see, um, in my opinion. Uh, back to the video games really quickly. If a six-year-old plays Grand Theft Auto for a week, which I don't encourage happening, but let's say he does. Okay, what's the worst thing that could happen to him? He'll be fine. He'll probably won't even remember by the time he's 20, 15 or something. Like, he won't remember it. He'll be like, I played Grand Theft Auto when I was six. Um, look, I feel so bad for these, uh, like, rock star company, these video game companies, because they have to listen to all this crap from parents. I just give him a bit of middle finger and walk off and walk off the podium because I don't really care. As terrible as that sounds, these kids were messed up. They shot kids because they wanted to, because they were sick, and they needed help. These parents are desperate, so they're trying to protest anything but their kids. Like they, they don't punish their kids. They, they blame anything else because they don't want to believe that little Timmy shot off a high school because he's just messed up. Um, <laughs> I mean. It, we live in America. It's about we have freedom of speech, freedom of press. If you want to go live in Nazi Germany, go ahead. I mean, I don't really care. Um, also, there are more important things to protest. Um, 
there are more important things to protest, like PETA. Like, PETA is a terrorist organization. Look up the stuff they do. It's messed up. And nobody gives them any crap for it. They show, like, they're horrible. They, like, their methods are terrible. And they're a terrorist organization, for lack of a better word. They scare people to get their way. So we should, somebody should be trying to take them down. Why the hell aren't they? Uh, people complain. They go, like, I am. They go, oh, PETA sucks, you know? But they don't go, you know, we gotta go protest. This is, that's actually something worth protesting. Uh, what could we protest? Uh, um, we could protest, um, release the government documents that we should see. Like, I don't believe the UFO documents. Like, there are UFO documents, by the way. And the government won't distribute them. Why the hell not? We need to see those. Um, but we're gonna protest Grand Theft Auto and Resident Evil? Are you kidding me? Freedom of speech, people. And you, they, they even rate movies and video games for you people. And you can't even distinguish that the game isn't for kids if it has someone holding a machine gun on the front of it. You're an idiot if, you, if you're a mother and you're like, oh, and if you buy the game for your kid, you give it to your kid. Okay, I'm not the parent. I'm not selling what the kids will play. Um, but, then if you, but then if you blame, if you get angry at the game for the content that's in it, when it's clearly not for kids, um... Come on, that's, that's crazy, that's insane. You're an idiot. You are an idiot. And you deserve no attention to the media whatsoever. You should not blame the media. Ba if you think the media is bad now, guess what? In ancient Rome, they would freaking kill people in a coliseum. That's, some, that's, okay, that's bad media. That's something we can't allow to go on, like actually killing people. When a stupid little video game, come on. Oh, the media is so corrupt, it's corrupting little Timmy. No, it's not. It's... It, the media's not that bad. They don't even allow F-words on TV or S-words. Please, cry me a freaking river. Please.